So I'm lucky enough to teach a course in global geophysics at my university, um, but unfortunately have to do marking, which every lecturer hates. Um, but I'm grateful that I get to mark very interesting essays. Each of my students choose a different place boundary. And I just wanted to share an example of one of the essays that I got um, about the Himalayas. And so the student has used um, Kumar 2020 as a reference. And so on the left here is the pre-air gravity anomaly over the Himalayas in the north here and in the south is India. And on the right-hand side is a Breguet anomaly over Himalaya in the top and again India at the bottom. And so I just thought it was such an interesting example to see. So on the left, you can really see how the free air map picks up the topography and then these high east-west mountain ranges. And on the right-hand side, the Breguet anomaly is really picking up variations in the subsurface density. And so we've got a big Breguet low. And this is most likely due to just thicker crust in the region. Because we've got a high mountain, the crust is accommodating it um, by bending and flexing. And so we've got a deeper moho. Um, so yeah, thicker crust. I mean, it also could be due to factors in the lithospheric mantle. But yeah, just a nice, simple example to see the two gravity maps side by side. 